Hey guys, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We're saving the world one trailer at a time. Today we're going to look at a beautiful trailer. It's a 2020 Eagle 317 RLOK. That stands for Rear Living Outside Kitchen, which is kind of a neat combination. You don't always see that. Um, let's, uh, let's get into it. Right up front here, we have a beautiful silver or gray front cap, wraps around the corners, gives you a really nice positive seal. This one here is optioned on with the more ride pin box. That actually shifts front to back three inches. Really helps you with the chucking. You've got some nice looking uh, orange LED lights and then some uh, white LED lights here in the side that are just cool looking, especially at nighttime. And then here at the front, we have ourselves like a rougher style storage. This is just for things like batteries or generators, uh, you know, uh, blocks, levels, those kind of things. All the Jayco uh, door locks on here are uh, key to like, so it's actually one key for all the doors, which is nice. On this side here, we're gonna have a 30 pound per paint tank, one on each side, and then we have ourselves our pass-through storage right here. So it goes all the way through the other side. It's nicely lit up. It's got a battery disconnect in there. Um, we've got ourselves our water heater bypass, outside shower, winterizing gate valves, sanitizing cable and salad inlet. This light right here is actually motion sensor, so when this door pops open, light lights up. And then this whole storage in here is heated, keeping all that stuff nicely heated. This one has the optional uh, auto leveling, electric auto leveling. We have ourselves a six gallon gas electric water heater, our furnace vent, and then 50 amp service here in this model. We've got that teed down to uh, 30, then 15, but you get the idea. Right here is our fridge vents, and this model here has the optional slide toppers as well. When you look at these new videos, guys, always pay attention to those options because not every Eagle is going to be created with the same options, and it's going to change VIN to VIN, so always check that out. We've got ourselves a rear roof ladder here in this one, a uh, hitch here at the back with four-way wiring ready to go so you can actually pull something behind there. We've got two awnings here, so one right starting right here off the slide. Covers our outside kitchen for us. The outside kitchen itself has that grill built in. Pop down uh, like a beer opener right there. Outside TV, some good storage here above, and like a two and a half cubic foot fridge right here. Notice this is all covered with this awning, and then our main awning starts right there and goes all the way to the front. So pretty well the full length of the trailer is awning coverage. We got LED lights in both awnings. We've got outside speakers down below. Just the other side there, our pass-through storage. Nice and clean. The optional more ride steps here. I like this extra handle here, making things easier to get in. Awesome, guys. That was the outside. Let's look inside. Hey, guys, we're inside the bedroom of that 317RLOK. You're looking across the bed here. Uh, right at the front, you're going to see a, uh, uh, like a, a front closet, I guess you'd say. We got some good shelves in here, four shelves. We've also got the TV boxes. Uh, for the unit here that's, that are kind of in the way. But then we have a hanging bar that goes right from here right to the other side, and then a shelf here as well, and then some shelves in behind. Get this Good production value there in the video. Bar comes right across, shelf, 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 shelf right there as well. And then here on this side, we have some more storage, just a big open storage there. And then down below, uh, some more storage again. This is also the prep for the washer dryer, which you can see in through there. Um, it's meant for like a accommodation unit kind of thing uh, in that uh, bottom shelf where those shelves come out. Great. One other thing I love about this bedroom, and it's the same bedroom on the 321 or the 317, is this uh, uh, big extra window here we get in the bedroom, bringing us some nice natural light. We've got ourselves a bedroom TV. That's an option. It's on this one. And then here's our dresser with seven drawers. <clears throat> so, so the top ones are a little smaller. And then the bottom three get a little bigger for you. All right. There is some storage underneath the bed. And then there's windows on either side of the bed with those fancy uh, blue kind of reading lights there for nighttime. We get bedside tables and we do get receptacles on both sides as well. Great, guys. Let's uh, turn around, head into the washer. <clears throat> So as you walk in the washroom, you're going to see we have a undermount recess sink, seamless countertop here, big medicine cabinet, LED lights in behind, <clears throat> and then a big cupboard down below the uh, vanity as well. 
right on. The shower itself is a little low for Josh, um, but uh, good space here overall, good shoulder space, elbow space, got a skylight, got ourselves a, a shower head of course, porcelain toilet down below, good hip space here for us wider individuals, and then some good linen closet in there. Cool, let's head down the stairs, have a look at living space. <clears throat> this is our main door right here. We're walking in the main door, and right away, we have ourselves a closet. Okay, so a spotty hanger jackets, maybe a spot you can set your shoes. Now, if you don't want to use this as a closet, you can actually flip this down, and that can be made into a pantry for you. Cool. Then, we have our actual pantry, which is right here. Look at all that sh shelving there. I don't think you need two pantries. I think you can leave that one as a closet. This is a pantry. I uh, don't know if you noticed, but it was a motion sensitive light that came on when I opened the door. This has the optional uh, 12 cubic foot, actually this is 13 and a half cubic foot gas electric fridge. Um, good space in through here. It's by Dometic. Uh, little drawer down below. These are all soft closed drawers here in the kitchen. That new blue Furion uh, range with glass stovetop, 27 inch oven, drawer down below, and then four drawers here beside. Good amount of counter space here, covered here above, and then a big, good looking microwave there. It's not convection, it's just a regular microwave. Good solid surface countertops, undermount sink, stainless steel with two sides. In here, we've got ourselves a good spot for a garbage can. And this has that removable Jayco uh, water jug that comes out of this, uh, that little spigot right there. So you can go to the grocery store, buy a jug or get it filled and just uh, operate that right there, uh, just for the, the kitchen tap right there. Awesome. Drawer here, more cupboard there, and then we got ourselves a pop-up receptacle right there. Theater seats are across from our, are across from our um, <clears throat> TV. Big window here, big windows across the back, tri-fold sofa, good storage here above. More storage there. More storage there. TV's right here, it's a large TV. I believe there's some storage in behind the TV. Let's see here. Yep, so there's some shelf all the way back there. <clears throat> and then we have some good storage here, fireplace down below, freestanding table and chairs with four windows here in the slide out on the door side of the camper, giving you some good visibility there. Awesome guys, hope you liked that video. If you did, please push the like button, it does help us out. Also subscribe, because we're gonna keep on putting out videos every day. Our email here is sales at lazyacres.com or our phone number 705-833-2539. Thanks guys, have a good day.